Semislav Defense, Antimarin, Anti-Moscow Gambit. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. White drubbed Black in the end game. The Reedy is a less common but flexible opening that controls the center with the knight before committing a pawn. D5 occupies the center and controls the E4 and C4 squares. C4 attacks the D5 pawn, daring Black to to trade on C4, if this trade occurs then White will have two center pawns versus Black's one center pawn. C6 supports the D5 pawn and allows the queen to develop on the queen side. This prepares the bishop for development. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts to fight for the e4 square. e6 supports the d5 pawn and allows the dark squared bishop to develop. Bg5 ignores the attack on the c4 pawn and develops the bishop, pinning the knight on f6. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This moves the bishop to safety. That pawn was free for the taking. This reveals an attack on a pawn. This kicks an opposing bishop. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only move that works. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This threatens to pin a knight to the king. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is the last book move. This threatens to attack a trapped bishop. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This stops the opponent from being able to attack a trapped bishop. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked knight. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This leads to losing a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is the way to win a pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Takes back. It is best. That was a free pawn. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This misses a better way to move a queen to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This prevents the opponent from castling, which generates tactical opportunities by keeping the king in the center. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The game was close to balanced but now white is worse. It is a mistake. There was only one good move there. It is a miss. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is good. Black had the advantage, but now white does. It is a mistake. 
there was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. It is good. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is good. This misses an opportunity to move a rook to safety. It is a mistake. That was a great move and very hard to find. It is brilliant. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This misses a better way to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a mistake. This ignores an opportunity to take an outpost with a bishop. It is a miss. That's fine. It is good. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is excellent. This stops the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is best. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a mistake. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a miss. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a miss. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a miss. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is a miss. This is the strongest option. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. This ignores an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a mistake. Recaptures. It is best. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. This is an equal trade. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. Takes back. It is best. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a mistake. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a knight. It is a miss. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This ignores an opportunity to move a knight to safety. It is a mistake. This misses a great but hard to find move. There was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This permits the opponent to take an outpost with a knight. It is a mistake. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. It is excellent. This loses material. It is a mistake. This is a fair move. It is good. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. Recaptures, from a previous move. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. This is the start of the end game and white is winning. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This permits the opponent to fork pieces. It is a mistake. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is excellent. This activates the king in the end game by getting it off of the back rank. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. This reveals a check on the opponent's king. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This evades the check from the rook. It is best. Right on target. It is best. Very precise. It is best. 
This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is best. This allows a forced checkmate. It is an inaccuracy. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. White drubbed black in the end game. 